stick along for the ride and let me know what you think. This is part five. train station got to London successfully now I'll be heading off to meet Bruno because apparently he's in London taking some summer classes through Boston all right it's about 725 I left the rest of my family and I'm off to go meet Bruno it's like just under two miles away take about 40 minutes to get there sort of speed walking it so I met Bruno at the coffee shop he's back he's featured in another video here it's been too long how's it going Bruno pretty good how are you sir Outstanding as always. You I know? heard you were going on the cruise, so we are. How yes. are you feeling? I'm looking forward okay. to the burgers, you know? Wow. There's some burgers that you can get, get this guy's burger joints. Really? really sounds good. juicy really and good. delicious. Oh, yes, I'm very much looking forward to it. But nice. sounds like you're uh, making your way through classes and you got another final today. Yep, barely alive, yes. and I have a final in about, you know, one and a half hours. You gotta do, do some last minute cramming or something. Absolutely. But, yeah. So, yes, glad to have you back in the video again. So funny that you're in London and I'm like, oh, I'm going to London today. So no way, man. Super happy I could swing by and see you. So, yep, God's right. plan. Uh, maybe I'll see you. I don't know in China or something next. How cool something would that like be? That. Or Minnesota? Think, yes, or Minnesota. That'd or be Minnesota. awesome. Absolutely. Yeah, I'll see you around. Thank you, Bruno. You put me on a bus. Taking a train to Dover on platform one. Are we there yet? Just giving you a flashback to our hike. <laughs> we got places to be here. Yeah. We're leaving the port. Here we go out of Dover. There's the harbor patrol. Night two of the cruise. We're breaking out the squid at. Where I'm gonna be. Melanie said I am an elegant squid tonight because it's elegant night. Kind of rainy in Bergen today, but we made it to Norway. So are we going all the way up there? Maybe. Maybe. Looks like a lift. On the playground. Let's play. Whee. We can do this one. We're going to Ulriken. And so we can go there through this trail that way if you want. So instead of hiking on roads, we can hike on another trail. You betcha, we're going up. Bye, Melanie. The ship looks so tiny from here. Read it. Oh my goodness. It's like a toy ship. I don't know if she knows that I'm up here. Do do. Do do. Do 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 do. Oh. The look of death. Like, where is he? Man, I don't even see him. But I see her. I bet she has no idea. <laughs> hey. We found some sheep at the top of the mountain. We did go all the way to the spike. Hey, look at that. Ah, it's over there, haha. -ha. Uh, now we're on to the next part of the hike. And it is very rocky and wet and muddy. This should be fun. Oh boy. Yikes, yikes, made it. 
think I can trust that rock, but I'm not really sure. Avoided death once again. You hear that? There's nothing. There's just complete silence. Ah, <laughs> she didn't fall. Okay, now that is quite the feat of rock engineering. Sheep! We found some sheep. What's up, dudes? You guys are great. He's coming to say hi. What's good? <laughs> Bleh. <laughs> this trail runner has been booking it. Finally taking a break now, but oh my gosh. She got over there from over here in like 30 seconds. It was, there's our ship all the way down there. Look at how cloudy it is. We've been hiking like forever. Where are we going? It's been like five hours since we got off the cruise ship been walking the entire time. They're making us go all the way down there just to go all the way back up. <laughs> that kind of sucks. Look at how steep this is. How do we do that? That ain't even fair. She's scooting. <laughs> scooting along. Like this. Oh gosh. Oh boy. My trail runner dudes, how do you do this? I need advice from my uh, friendly neighborhood trail runners. Oh my gosh. Holy. Where am I going, dude? I'm getting there. Instead of a waterfall, she's gonna be a come a human fall. Ooh, it looks really pretty. Bro, it said like 11 kilometers, like Way back. an hour and a half ago, and now it says 8.2. Oh, I swear, I think they're mixing up kilometers and miles because, yeah. The well, at least the views are nice. I sure hope so. I found a little, a little sheep thingy. See the little guy. He's not great. Perfect spot for him to live. Wonder who put him there. I'll leave him right where I found him. Good sheep. Who's there? <laughs> Made it. Look at that. And this whole hike is like one step forward, two steps back. Are we still going all the way over there? Waterfall! This is epic. Look at the look at how cool this is. Oh my goodness. Wow. So I guess this is a drinking water reservoir. There's a waterfall over there, which is epic. There's a reservoir right here. And then it kind of flows through here. And there's another waterfall over there, which is also kind of epic. But we don't have any time to go and see down there because we gotta keep hiking. Yay! Don't fall, Melanie. Or if you do, just make sure it's in the next couple seconds while I'm recording. Cool. We have a mile marker sign or a kilometer marker sign. I don't think I want to look. Ah, you know what? Could be worse. It says 3.9 kilometers. Hey, that's better. That is hey. better. I'll take that. I'll take that. That's the first sign that I haven't been totally mad at. And now you can't see anything because it's all foggy and misty. And where the heck is our ship? I can't tell. Please don't break boards. Please don't break boards. Okay. Oh, you can barely even see the tower over here. Let's see how Melanie does it now. Like that. Okay. I... I freaking called it. Last sign was like 3.9. This one is like 4.3. And we walked like a mile in between. I... Oh my gosh. Let me start going. Huh. 
Uh, and some more up hill. Where do we even come from? Somewhere over there. But like, sure some decent views. But is it really worth it? What is up with this tower? Keep moving farther away. And why is it so foggy now? We were doing so well, we were two for two. The last two things we climbed, it's been like pretty foggy. And then like we get up there and it's been clear. And then we get down and it's pretty foggy again. So we'll see if we can press our luck. Go three for three with only, uh, uh, you know what? I don't even know how much distance the, the mile markers are wrong half the time. So only anywhere between one and five miles to go. Yeah, exactly. Don't run over people with bikes. Got it. So <laughs> where the heck is the little trolley tram thingamajigger down? Like where do we go up there? Do we go down this way? We came from all the way over at that little spire all the way in the distance. There's a tra tram thingy running over there. But no, not over here. I thought the top, I thought this tower was flying. No, it's never that easy. Still three and a half kilometers to go. Uh. Yep, we're officially lost again. Do we take a left or do we take a right to get over right that way right somewhere? There. I don't know. So the all-knowing Google Maps says that is the way to the bottom and it's another like, who knows, 40 something minutes. But if we go this way and it's wrong and we have to backtrack all that way. You know what, sure, let's just send it, let's go right. Why, why, why not, why not? Why not? Coming over the hill. Oh, I thought the cable car would be here. Where? It, but, I think that was power lines over there. Where the fudge are we going? Somebody explain! I don't understand. So we took a left because that building was not helpful. And now Melanie is scared for time. 425 and last call on the ship to get on the ship is 630. So we have two hours and a never-ending trail. So she's she has resorted to trail running. Um yeah, that's about it. I, I see no cable cars in sight, which is just wonderful. We might have to follow all-knowing Google and go down the mountain the long way. Yeah, repeat that. I see we send it. Run down hill when we can and then walk up hill. Sure, uh, but I should probably check Google Maps to make sure that we're going on the right way because I assume at this point we're just gonna aim for like going all the way down the hill instead of taking whatever non-existent cable car there is around here. Here's the real reason that I had no idea I was doing marathon training, goodness. Melanie didn't even train for a marathon this year, and look at that, we're like, I have no idea, 15 miles in, and uh, counting, I think this is like 30,000 steps just for this hike run thing of a jigger. Holy, whatever, we're just gonna, we're just gonna run for it. Bolt it straight to the bottom. Oh yeah, look at that view. Oh, there we go. That's a view right there, if I ever seen one. We're running backwards down a hill. We, we are gaining some ground here. I feel less stressed. <laughs> yes. Feeling better. I know we can make it. Running for the win. But this is absurd. This is absurd. As, as much as I would like the uh, YouTube video name, Stranded in Norway, Ship Left Without Us. <laughs> That's not I happening. I think today. it's better to get on the ship in time, which is, uh, we still have two hours until it blows its horn and goes, bye bye, Alan and Melanie. Yes. Here it says Ulrican thingy where we came from is 11.2 kilometers, but from over there Ulrican said to the Floyan it was 13 point something. But that's got to be more than 11 kilometers because be there's that's got to be closer to like 20. We here. Okay, where did we come from? We went all the way over here, here, and then we went. We did this, I think. Uh, or did we go this way? Uh, no. Let's see. We came up like this. Or maybe like this, I don't really know. And then we somehow went, where are we? We're over here? Holy, did we go all the way oh, the up here? And then like... What did we do? And then we're gonna go, we... We somehow got from here to here. By going right. Uh, yeah, yeah. Around this lake, because we weren't on the left side of the lake ever. Oh yeah, is that the little point all the way up there? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yikes! Well, this might have been a stupid decision. It's gravel and steep. Do we just run it? I'm trying to die. Yes. Here, you go first. 
Have fun. <laughs> We're going down. I'm sure you love those sound effects, don't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> now where are we going? Ooh, look, another sign for Floyd. You know what, Floyd? We're done. I'm breaking up with you. For real, though. This way? I hope your heart is broken, because you deserve it, Floyd. We're still running on some downhills here, so, uh... Making up a little bit of time on these crazy... Oh my goodness, that was very sharp switchback. Found a little waterfall. Oh, look at how cool the waterfall is. It's a nice little creek and a little waterfall. Let's push through. Do it for the burgers, Melanie. Do it for the burgers. Onward and downward. And in our continual struggles, we have to take a left. At least not a right. And this is a right. And this must be our left, which is... It has barely looks like a trail. Maybe some other disheartened hiker drew hearts on it because they were like, finally, a way out. Straight to Skredderdalen. Bergen. Bergen. Huh, only 2.1 kilometers from Floyd. Uh, <laughs> that's a lie. Uh, that's be just, a lie. just, 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 uh, that's better. <laughs> I didn't get a clip of the lake that was right behind us. Look at, look at how crystal clear it is. Uh, I would be loving this if we hadn't walked about 35,000 <laughs> steps so far today. Thanking God a little extra today for Google Maps because I would be completely lost if it were not for my boy Google. Oh, hey, look at that. Another waterfall. No way. We're getting closer, but not very close. I have no idea where the ship is, but it is somewhere that away. Man, oh man, I did not expect it to be that steep again. <laughs> she brought her sticks back out. Can I help you? Yeah, get us down that way. You're younger, you do it. Uh. Yeah, where is she? Yeah, yeah. Huh. Where the heck? Oh, she's behind some trees. Huh. You know, if we hadn't been walking for like 15 miles already, I'd say this is kind of a nice hike. Ah! Can I see the end? No. Why would I be able to see the end? You know, I think if extreme hiking is a sport, I think that's what we're doing right now. Oh, uh, it'll be a four-hour hike. Four-hour hike my butt. Woo! Woo huh, near miss. Too many rocks here. Look at what we have to deal with. This isn't even the bad part. Like, there are, there are much worse parts here. Ooh, more stream shots. If you haven't seen enough of these already. Stream shot. Oh my goodness. There are buildings. Bergen buildings. I don't know where the ship is, but there are buildings. Where in the heck is that ship? Oh crap. We still have uh, an hour and 10 minutes to get on the ship. Ah, paved ground, paved path. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. I might cry. Uh, don't cry yet. We have to get to the ship first. The ship, it is, it is behind the tree. It's right there, I can see it. It's right there. Even the paved hill though is very, very steep. Okay. Norway, the gift that just keeps on giving. Look at how steep this hill is, goodness. Hey dogs, no pooping here. You got that? And a kiosk. Just can't get enough of these hills. I think we're almost there, but I also thought we were almost there like an hour ago, so. Some cool Norway roofs, which you needed to see in this video. Yeah, we're going down some funky, there you go, that is very sharp. <laughs> Look at that, it's like alongside the, I anyways. Guess. Okay, our ship should be straight ahead. Maybe it's on the other side and it's just blocked behind that building. Uh, I... This doesn't look right, this doesn't look like our ship. You, think, you don't think so? All right, let's just keep going straight, maybe and around the... Enough. Ship is not there, so we managed to hike from about here all the way up to that mountain top where that spike is, and all the way over here, and all the way over there, and now we're coming back here, and our cruise ship is somewhere over there. So I think the cable car tram thing we were looking for was all the way up there, but we were all the way over there somewhere. So that didn't work out very well for us. We, we are 
back to the fish market, which feels like we should have been here like 30 minutes ago. So we were a bit lost. Cruise ship can't exactly find it. It's somewhere behind all these buildings over here. But we walked past this Irish pub over here behind us. And so we know we're going the sort of correct direction. We just don't know if we need to go left or straight, but I think it's straight. I think it's straight and left. Straight and left. A lot of work, but we found it. We're on the ship. It's been eight and a half hours since I started this hike. About 38,000 steps and counting. I might end up just making a video out of this whole adventure here, <laughs> rather than like the whole cruise as a video. I think this deserves its own video it because, does. oh my goodness, this was a long day, but the cruise ship has not left without us. I took the steps, I'm only somewhere back there. <sighs> Ooh, come on. Hello? Nobody's even in here. Where's my burger? I want my burger, please. Guys, it's closed, so I really hope the parents got us burgers. The parents did not get my last text, and they did not get burgers. Very sad. Very, very sad. Oh, where am I going? I'm only still in the room rinsing off, but you know, as a substitute for burgers, this isn't too bad, I suppose. It's pretty decent, but burgers still would have been better. We are off now. It is like 7.25 p.m. We got some birds flying along. What's up, bird? I'm gonna hold my phone firmly. And going under the bridge soon. Here we go, under the bridge. We're not even out of Bergen yet. Oh, Still have a bit to sail. Goodness, it is a like long channel here. It looks like we're on the edge. Well, we're not on the Norway like though, because there's still a lot of stuff. No. Yeah, I think I've seen enough fur of Norway for one day, so. See you later, Norway. <laughs>